This is the first video in the series on solving geometric optics problems for IIT JAM preparation. So in this series, we would be looking at geometric optics problems. These problems would be helpful in clearing the IIT JAM entrance exam for MSc admission in physics. So just as a background of my educational background, I did my MSc in physics from IIT Kanpur and I had cleared the JAM exam to gain admission into IIT. So let us start with the first problem. So the first question is a spherical a spherical surface of radius radius of Curvature R separates air with a radius uh, with a refractive index of one. Air we are taking its refractive index to be approximately equal to one. separates air from glass glass having a refractive index of 1.5 the center of curvature is in glass this would help us determine the concavity or convexivity point object p placed in air is found to have a real image Q in the glass. The line PQ cuts the surface at a point O such that so cuts up at point O such that PO is equal to OQ then the question is calculate the distance PQ in terms of the radius of curvature R. So let us draw the diagram for this question. So we have a curved surface this is the curved surface we have a point P and this is imaged inside this curved surface at some point Q this point is O 
so let us solve this question so we have the formula for spherical um, surfaces spherical refractive surfaces the formula is as follows So this is the formula for refraction from spherical surfaces. This is refraction from spherical surfaces. Using this formula, we will solve our question. In our question, we are given that n1 is equal to 1.0 that is air so sub, uh, the subscript 1 denotes the starting medium the medium where the object is placed and the subscript 2 denotes the medium in which the image is placed so n2 over here is 1.5 this is inside glass u is minus po we are using the conventional sign convention so since the rays would start from here from the object so this object distance is negative And this is the origin that we are taking, this point right here. The image, image is formed at a distance V. V is OQ. And we are given, we are given, sorry, not PQ, PO is equal to OQ so we are given this so let us put this in this refraction formula substituting these values over here gives us 1.5 divided by OQ minus 1 divided by minus PO is equal to 1.5 minus 1 over R, R being the radius of curvature. So let us simplify this. Now we can use this given fact that PO is equal to OQ. So we can write This is since we are given that PO is equal to OQ. Thus we get PO in terms of R as follows. So this is PO, we were supposed to find the distance PQ, so PQ is PO plus OQ and since PO is equal to OQ, this is 2 times PO and PO we just found out is 5 times R, so this is 10 times R. This solves the question, it was a simple question based on this formula of refraction from spherical surfaces. 
So this was the key formula in this question.